so guys hello everyone welcome to you all in my computer screen so today i'm going to teach you to create professional identity card in google docs it is too much easy and simple so first of all you have to click in the plan so after that it will create another new document okay so i'm just closing this one okay and just i am uh, giving the name this one professional uh, id card right okay then after that just you have to click in the insert okay then just you have to click in the drawing and just you have to click in the new and the drawing panel will open inside your browser okay so now we can see here just you have to click in the shapes and there are various type of the shapes available arrow clouds and equation type of the shapes available here okay so first of all i'm going to draw rectangle shape okay so now you can see this is the rectangle shape and just you can fill the shape using various type of the color for example i am just choosing this type of the color okay and i am just making the border color is transparent okay and after that just you have to drag another shapes here so i am dragging another uh, this type of the rounded rectangle and i am dragging here okay yeah like that and i am just giving the color is red okay and i am uh, sending it back okay so from here just right click okay just wait for a moment right click uh, and order and just send to back okay then after that just you have to okay and uh, then after that just you have to uh, draw another rectangle shape here yeah? okay so i'm just going to shape and i am just dragging another shape and i am just making the color is white color here and i am just making the uh, line color is transparent okay just i am going to drag this one like this okay in this way yeah like that and i am just bringing this one in the front side okay and i am just bringing this shape also in the front side okay then after that i am just dragging another rectangle shape here and i am just making the color is white color and the line color is transparent okay so now we can see my shape is drawing perfectly okay then again i am just going to drag this one in this side i have to drag this one also in this side okay like that then after that i am just dragging over around it rectangle shape from here okay then like that and after that i am just dragging on the uh, rectangle sorry circle type of the shape in the corner like that and i am just making the color is red and line color is transparent then after that just i'm going to click in the shape and i am just clicking here and making the color is white okay then after that i am just uh, making the border color is transparent and again i am just dragging on the shape and dragging this one from here and making like this okay so after that again i am dragging on the rectangle shape from here okay so i am just dragging this one like this from here okay in this side and i am just making the color weight and border color is transparent again i am clicking in the shapes and i am drawing a rectangle shape to create a professional business card inside google docs okay then after that so now we can see my shape is done okay so here i should to put a photo okay so for this one i am just going here or you can directly put photo from here also from the custom there are various type of the color I think there should be various type of the color 
okay so i think there is no uh, photo option so i am just directly dragging my image from here okay so i am just going to in the pixabay.com so where you can get various type of the real big free images so i am just uh, searching a professional photo okay then after that i am searching a photo inside pixabay.com otherwise you can use another type of the uh, photos also here okay so i think i should to use this one okay so i want to give credit to this guy okay so who uploaded this photo and after that i am just copying this u this url and i'm coming here and from the by url i'm pasting that url here okay so i think this is not working here so i'm just right click here and just click in the copy in as address and i'm pasting it here so now this image is came here and i'm just clicking this slip there was a problem from the retrieving the specified image so i think i should to download this one from here download and click in the download i'm not a robot and click in the download so i'm just going to use this photo uh, but uh, i'm going to give um, uh, the credit for this photo for the alexander Lavanov, uh, who are the contributor of pixami.com thanks man for providing this photo okay and i am just clicking here in the image and from the upload choose image to upload or you can directly drag this photo here also okay so i am uploading this photo yeah and i am just going to drag this one here and drag this one from this side okay yeah like that oh i think this is not the perfect photo for me so I think I should to drag on the portrait photo here. So I'm just going to another website that is pixels.com. Okay, you can get royalty free images from here. So I am uh, just searching girls photo. Okay. Then after that, so now you can see there are various type of the portrait photo. So I think I should to uh, choose I should to choose another photo okay so I am just going to use this photo okay and okay then after that I am just going to the free download and I am just downloading the medium size and just click in the download and uh, I want to give the credit for this photo uh, from uh, for the Leonardo Monterio okay I am not pronouncing this one uh, especially uh, correctly but thanks uh, for the photographer who provided this photo in the royalty free website and after that again i am just going to click here in the image and i am just dragging this photo here and the photo is uploading inside my google docs okay so now the photo came here and i am just going to resize this photo and i am just creating here okay like that and i'm just dragging this photo okay so in this way also you you can use your photo and you can give the uh, border size from here okay yeah like that then after that you can use the company logo okay guys so now i'm going to use a company logo so for this one just click in the image and choose an image to upload and after that i'm just going here and i think i have few logo here uh, yeah so this is uh, uh, one of my logo so which is I created okay so after that I am just going to resize it and I'm just going to keep the logo here okay yeah, like that okay so just wait for a moment Yeah, like that okay then after that i am just going to use a text here okay so now i think i should to minimize this one yeah, like that okay then i am just using a text box here so from here i am just dragging a text box and i am just typing here name okay 
and you can change the font from here uh, okay then after that you can resize your font size from here uh, i am just increasing the size uh, a little bit then after that you have to drag another text box here i am dragging here and i am just typing job position okay job position yeah like that and after that you can change the font okay i am just dragging this one like that then i am just decreasing the size here okay yeah like that and i am just selecting here and yeah like that okay then after that i am resizing this one again a little bit up yeah like that okay uh, i am just changing the color also here so i am just making the font color is little bit brown color All right. and after that you have to use the id so for this one again i am just dragging a uh, uh, text box and i am just typing the id okay and id you you can give anything for your company okay and i am changing the font again in the impact and i am uh, decreasing the font uh, the font size uh, like that okay and then after that i think this is little bit long so that i am decreasing the size and again i am just uh, creating another text box and drawing here and i am just giving join date then after that you can type mm slash dd slash yy okay then after that i am just changing the font in the impact i am decreasing the font size and stressing this one from here okay then i am just putting here oh, sorry i am just dragging this one here okay like that so in this way okay so now i'm just using uh yeah uh, sorry uh, i'm using a uh, barcode here so for this one just i'm going to here and i'm just using a barcode so i think i should go in the pixels.com and i'm sourcing a barcode so now you can see there are various types of the barcode right so i think i should use a barcode generator uh, and I am just clicking here and there are various type of the tools available which help us to uh, create a barcode okay so you can also use this website okay so I am using thepastry.com.np okay double 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 dot and after that you you can generate this one from here okay i am just copying this one and close otherwise you can download from here also so i am downloading here and just come here and again you have to uh, upload another image i am using a, a barcode here and uploading this one here again you have to resize this one okay so in this way and you can directly drag this one here okay yeah, like that okay so now you can see here i have created a simple type of the uh, id card inside google docs and just click in the save and close okay so now you can see here my uh, id card is created from here okay so from the image option you, you can do various types size rotation and another type of the things you can do okay guys so now you can also create this type of the beautiful professional id card in google docs hoping that you get few ideas and i'll come back with another new video until that goodbye see you again